Here are four ways to add a photograph to your WordPress blog post. The first way is to simply upload a photograph into your blog post. You could be in either visual or HTML mode. All right. So you have your cursor in there. You click on this icon. Click on Browse. Upload the image and then you can put it right into your blog post from here. The one thing you might want to do is remove the link to the image. That way, when you put it into your blog post, it's not clickable and going to the image itself. In some blogs, you know, you'll see a blog and then there'll be an image and you'll be able to click on it and all of a sudden you'll go to that image itself. So that's one way to do it. The second way is you can go to what's called a media library. Now, a media library is basically a library of all images that you've uploaded into your WordPress blog. So there might be something uh, in the past that you've uploaded that you might want to reuse. So, for example, I have a Facebook logo. All right? So if I write a blog post on Facebook, I can simply use this logo again. It's, it's a nice looking image. I can easily use it again. Okay. The third way you'll notice is that it says from URL. If you click on from URL, what it's asking is for you to put in the image path directly here and then the image title right here. One source that I use frequently is Creative Commons on Flickr. So it's flickr.com forward slash Creative Commons. All right, you can look at the licensing here and uh, the mo most of the photos are here in attribution, no commercial. So you click on see more, do a search here. Okay. Once you find a photograph that you like, you simply click on it. You'll go to the page that has the information on the photograph. The next thing you want to do is click on all sizes so that you can see the options that you have for the size of the image. You click the size that you want. In this case, I'm choosing 330 by 500. And then you mouse over the image. What you do is you left click. If you have a Mac, you just kind of put the control button down. And you click on copy image location. All right, click on that. Go back into your blog post. That's going to be your image path. It's going to end in .jpg. That means JPEG image. All right. Okay, so in the image title, what I do is I put the title of the photograph, or you can just put a quick description like clouds over the water. That way people with screen readers can read what the image is. So I do that. And alternate text, I also put the title or maybe a description of the photograph. Now under caption, I put the author, the person that created the photograph. Put that directly in photo by, okay? And then link image two, I will simply go to this person's Flickr profile. All right, that way they get attribution under the image, and then also there's a link directly to their profile in Flickr, which is generally what people like. There is attribution right here, and then you're done. The fourth way is to use a plugin. So I actually have a plugin called WP Flickr. All right, what that does is that takes your specific Flickr account and pulls photographs into it. So my recent photos are right here, okay? And if I want to, I can just go to my own Flickr library, import photos that I think might be relevant to the post. So for example, you know, I'm writing a post here and I say, you know, I want to, um, um, you know, I want to import an image right before a sentence, all right? So all I have to do is put my mouse where I want the photo. I go down to my, my library of my own personal Flickr photos. I click on an image. It's automatically going to show up in the WordPress post. And that's it. Okay? Bye.